Hello everybody, back here again from our vlog a day, and today is Friday the 7th, and today was a beautiful day outside. I mean, it was cold and a little windy, but sunny at least, um, not snowing, not icing, all that good stuff there, so definitely made it to be out to be a really nice day. So, got around, got a handful of things around here done, um, not really been getting as much done on that rental as I want. Just kind of been, I don't know, losing interest in the damn thing really quick, which happens to me at times, but oh well, who knows. So went ahead and headed out, got some running and stuff, had some errands to go run and that whatnot. Got that taken care of, luckily. Um, still, I don't know, kind of waiting to hear back on uh, mom's taxes. I don't know what the hell. When I turned them in, she was in the process of changing phone numbers. We were moving all that hassle factor of getting all that crap around. So I gave him my number. Still haven't called to say they're done yet. And it's, I don't know, it's been way too long. It's getting a little bit on the annoying side there. So just kind of blew that off and just kind of still waiting to hear from them. I don't know what's taking them so damn long, but I got a feeling they're going to lose her business as of next year just from this part here alone. Plus, I heard they charge normally about two times what her old accountant did and there's no reason for it. He Part of the contract with him moving all of his accounts over there is they had to charge his same fee this year, so she got the same fee. But next year, it's gonna go up double, and with this type of treatment, I understand they're probably busier than normal since they're taking on all his new clients, but the woman didn't seem apologetic at all, and she kind of made it sound like I could just stand there and wait while they did it, which wouldn't help me because she had to sign it. But I said, no, call me, call that number, so I think they think it's still her number. As soon as they're done, she'll stop back to work, she'll sign it, we'll be over and done with, whatever and whatnot. And just seemed like lousy customer service at that point. So other than that, um, I was supposed to go get myself some bananas, and I completely forgot. They were on sale today for like 28 cents a pound. And I 100% forgot about that until way late tonight and didn't really feel like going back out and doing that. Um, normally, I think the highest I've ever paid is like 59 cents a pound, so it's not like there are a lot of savings. But I need to get in there because I'm down to like probably like five or six bananas left. And I like really ripe bananas, and they don't sell those in the store, of course. So I got to start getting in there a little more often, maybe every couple of days, buying up some bananas, keeping them you know, ripening for me a lot better than that. Because right now I'm going through between two and three bananas a day. Um, just, I don't know, I'm on a banana kick right now. That'll change here before long and I'll be over that junk. But other than that, um, just been eating the same old thing, but I'm trying to eat the last couple days. Today is the second day of it. I ate myself backwards. So I had my worst calorie meal. Um, I had chili today for breakfast, Mountain Dew um, with Ritz crackers and the chili. And then I went from there to a banana also, like midday there, I had myself a roasted turkey sandwich um, with pickles and then I went to my um, chocolate milk after my run I guess my recovery drink there then I also end up finishing up the day with a um, hard-boiled egg and a um, fruit smoothie so exact backwards I don't know why I don't know if it's helped me or not who the hell knows but I'm thinking why put load in the worst calories in my body right before I go to bed late at night doesn't make any sense I need the more of that crappy stuff in the mid early day to put it through Part of me thinks it ain't gonna matter. Part of me thinks it might. Don't know yet. I'm gonna do the experiment, see what happens. It's all about how many calories come in, how many calories go out for exercise and that. Really don't matter when they show up, but I'm gonna give this a try and see what it does for me. So definitely, um, like I said, right now I'm not feeling any different at all. It's just kind of odd to usually like close out the evening with a Mountain Dew. I haven't noticed any difference in sleeping like that yet, so we'll see if that makes a difference after a few days of that. If it starts giving me issues or helps me sleep better maybe, so I'm not drinking all that caffeine right before I go to bed, but who knows. Um, thinking about possibly, oh, I got, I got my run today in um, on a two and a quarter mile, something like that. Not a very far run, just kind of went out and ran around, had a good time. It was a non-training day, so I didn't really have to go too far. Did a little workout on the bike, did a little one um, on the uh, elliptical machine there at the gym and the treadmill. So that wasn't too bad. The gym was actually surprisingly fairly packed for a Friday. Usually on a Friday there's like one other person if or nobody in there with me on this you know in the evenings on Friday, but there was actually like ten people in there. It's kinda weird. So I went ahead and kinda called that a little bit short, um, left early. I did re get my um by fog vader that like face mask thing I bought the other day I did kind of take the time to really get it fitted tight to my face and I velcroed on like super tight on my face today and my glass didn't fog up once so it's that's gonna hopefully um, work better for me I'm really excited about that working good 
And I'm kicking the idea around about possibly running a marathon tomorrow. I haven't made my mind up completely. And I definitely didn't eat good for it and carbo load or none of that crap tonight, uh, all day today for that. Didn't even really hydrate for it, but I'm kicking the idea around that they're calling for decent weather tomorrow. I'm gonna see what happens, how I feel in the morning and go from there. If not, I'm gonna try and do it maybe Tuesday, Wednesday um, next week and see what happens. So other than that, don't really know of anything going on. So I will talk to you guys later. Have yourself a safe and wonderful day. Thanks for watching.